All right, guys, so I made a boo-boo here. My battery died last, uh, this morning. I didn't hold the charge for some reason. Then I realized, wait a minute, let me check some things out, and I figured out what it was. Inside of here, I have my charge controller. And now this charge controller here was set up wrong, okay? This charge controller was set up for a lithium battery, not a lithium phosphate battery. There's a difference. The phosphate battery holds a longer uh, charge. That means it stores 14.6 volts into the battery before the battery uh, stops charging the uh, controller, stops sending voltage to the battery. Uh, the way it was set up before, it was only adding 12.6 to the battery. The battery was almost dead, okay? Uh, it did its job. The whole, everything shut down once it hit the 9 volts. Everything shut down once I put it back on to the sun and charged perfectly fine. Now that everything is set up right, uh, this thing again is supposed to hold. I'll show you here. Charge voltage, 14.6. And I'll show you now that I got it set up right. Um, this is the charge voltage. Once it gets to that point, it stops charging the battery. Uh, it runs continuously at 12 volts. It stops, uh, it shuts down the entire system. Once it reaches 9.5 volts, this will be continuously running uh, at, this is the actual code that I had mistakenly put B2 when it's supposed to be that B3. This is what's coming in right now. It's a cloudy day outside, uh, so this thing will take some time to charge fully. Uh, again, my bigger battery was having the same problem. Uh, when I checked the uh, controller on that one as well, it was also set up to B2, which was my mistake. I changed it around, so I know I'll get that battery completely filled, and I'll be able to enjoy using that battery the way it's supposed to be used. Uh, but right now, this one needs some time to charge. I am charging my currently my phone, uh, because my phone was almost dead. Uh, but everything's uh, so far looking up. Uh, I'll probably post another review here showing, uh, uh, at least letting y'all know how long this charge is going to last for once I get it completely charged. Uh, the way it was set up already, where I was only getting 12.6, it lasted me one night. And that one night I was able to charge my phone, my tablet, uh, my phone a couple of times. Uh, my Bluetooth speakers, um, a lot of stuff, uh, but again, the light always stays on, so it's consuming power. Uh, you got the light showing the voltage on this thing, that's always on. Uh, also, the charge controller is always on, uh, so there's always power coming out of that. Uh, so, but I mean... Right now, everything seems to be good uh, good to go. Um, I'll just have to let this thing charge up until I get a full charge, and then we'll go from there, and we'll do another review here in the future. Uh, again, uh, thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed this, just give me a thumbs up.